hello dear students i uh, hope you are all doing well as uh, most of the students will be in search how to pass applied physics for the mechanical stream okay as you already know i'm making the passing package for the video students okay today i'm with the subject applied physics for mechanical stream subject code is uh, bphym 102202 if somebody has backlog also they can also refer these important questions okay and uh, you should know one thing uh, over here in each and every subject there are two ways to pass the subject okay one way is you should go through three modules fully okay you should not skip anything uh, from the syllabus okay that is the one way if you want to pass the subject okay another way is you should go through each and every module taking the imp only important important questions from each and every module okay that is the another way of passing so it is your choice uh, which you will choose so it is according to your own convenience okay i will not force you people just to go through only three modules sometimes uh, uh, students are very weak in the numerical part so they can they are skipping those numerical parts from module so better to go through each and every module taking important questions which i will discuss in this particular video okay so let us start with the passing module that is module fifth in which you have to cover some uh, diagrammatic or construction questions which are the very important ones and you should just go through the diagrammatic part try to understand the concept and you can easily write down the theoretical part in the examination in your own words so with neat sketch write the principle and construction and uh, working of x-ray diffractometer explain with neat sketch the working principle of atomic force microscopy afm write down its applications and some other sketches are there uh, explain with the neat sketch the working of sem tem xps scanning electron microscopy transmission electron microscopy x-ray photo electron spectroscopy okay and determine crystal size by uh, Cheerer equation and uh, write a short note on nanomaterials and nano composites so these are the five questions which you have to go through and uh, why i calling it as a passing module just because there are a lot of diagrammatic part okay you should practice only the diagrams okay rest of the theory uh, you know already in the video examination if suppose uh, this question is for eight marks okay four marks will be for the sketch and four marks will be for the theory so they are just focusing on the uh, sketch part if you have drawn uh, neatly over there okay so main focus should be uh, sickage part over here okay so this much portion you have to cover from the model fifth and uh, there are some numericals maybe if you are convenient go through the numerical part also if you find easiness then definitely go through and let me know in the comment section if you want separate videos on the numericals i can make, uh, make it for you people okay so this is the model fifth now if i come to the model first uh it is again a passing module in which you have to cover some super important questions like explain with neat sketch working of ready shock tube and define shock waves write down characteristics and applications of shock waves and uh, here we have uh, what is a uh, simple harmonic motion and write the differential equation for shm there is no derivation for it only you have to write down the differential equation for simple harmonic motion okay now another question is from second sorry first module this is what are forced oscillations obtain an expression for displacement and amplitude of forced vibration okay so already i have made separate video for this derivation also if you are feeling it uh, difficult so i can uh, provide the link in the description box you can avail this important derivation okay this is the super important question next is discuss the theory of dampened oscillations hence arrive at the case of critical damping last but not least is the derived expression for equivalent force constant for springs in series and parallel what is an expression for the period of its oscillation it is again a super important question and some numericals are there if you are convenient go through it i am again telling you physics is the subject where in each and every model there is the intermixing of theory and a numerical part okay so you cannot skip actually the numerical part but it is possible uh, to pass the physics subject only by theory portion if you are covering all uh, portions whatever i have mentioned so far and whatever i will uh, tell you later on in this particular video okay so next passing module which is the model second in which uh, the super important question or relationship is uh, derive the relationship between young's modulus rigidity modulus and poisson's ratio where symbols have their own meaning and state and explain hoax law with the help of stress strain diagram define elastic limit okay so you should go through this stress strain curve also separately uh, not only with the hoax law sometimes they will separately ask you draw the stress strain diagram okay uh, explain uh, stress strain diagram right next is define bending moment derive an expression for bending moment in terms of moment of inertia and uh, some definitions are there define the following elastic moduli okay poisson's ratio and uh, limiting values of poisson's ratio stress hardening and 
softening over there okay now write a short note on failures of engineering materials and factors affecting fatigue last question mention relationship between uh, bulk modulus youngest modulus and Poisson's ratio okay and also numericals are there okay if you find easiness in the numericals then go through it okay now module third discuss the seaback effect and peltier effect with their coefficients and describe the construction and working of thermoelectric generator and thermoelectric cooler okay teg and uh, tec derive the expression for uh, thermo eff sorry thermo emf in terms of t1 and t2 and describe the construction and working of thermocouples and uh, thermophile and also mention their advantages okay sometimes they will also you mention four advantages also but you should go through the advantages five to six advantages of uh, these thermocouples and thermophile explain the application of uh, thermoelectricity and uh, numericals on thermocouple are there okay in both the parts both the chapters so go through it this much is enough for the module third okay now come to the module four in which uh, there are some important questions like what is uh, joule thompson's effect derive the expression delta t is equal to p1 minus p2 divided by cp uh, multiplied by 2a by rt minus b with three cases okay now explain the construction and working of a porous plug uh, experiment and a platinum resistance thermometer lindy's at liquefier okay so go through the construction part as i discussed earlier uh, it uh, it is of the four marks wettage if uh, question is for eight marks okay explain the liquefaction of helium and write down its properties explain briefly the applications of cryogenics in uh, aerospace tribology and food processing last question write a short note on liquefaction of oxygen by cascade process okay and also numericals are simpler ones in this chapter also okay if you are uh, feeling easiness if you are comfortable with the numerical part then go through it okay and i have earlier told you uh, in this particular video that there are two ways to pass the physics subject okay i hope you understood my points over here and i wish you all the best uh, for your examinations my dear friends and uh, thanks for watching my video and share this video to all your friends uh, who actually need it